Hello there, my fire sign collective. I hope you're having a wonderful day. What's up, fire signs? You can ring my bell. Ring my bell. Oh, fire signs. What is going on? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Uh-oh, we about wanted to skip the oracle card. What's going on with you, fire signs? God protects me and God fights my battles. No weapon formed in spirit or physical against me shall prosper. I'm highly favored and protected from all evil, as is my beautiful fire sign collective. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. What the fuck is going on? We got a rebirth energy here, but damn, something is cold. You're as cold as ice. Now, this card showed up in reverse, and y'all, I really had to take a look at it to figure out what the fuck it was. Now, you notice the hand, one hand is a sword, and the other has like a fake hand on it. So, I really feel that fire signs, you could be having to, to be a little cold to somebody wanting to come in. But this person is really up to no good, right? Uh, you can't trust the handshake and they're, they got a sword ready to stab you as well, right? This person don't want to do anything that's going to affect them as well, right? Uh, with that fake ass hand there, this could be someone trying to uh, manipulate you online. Someone trying to fraud you out of something. That ace of swords, or that sword's there. Well, I was wanting to say ace of swords. So you're going to know this energy because you can't trust them. Uh, that sword energy trying to break into uh, what you got. Uh, so keep your security up. You're as cold as ice here because you need to be. Yeah, you can't trust this person. This is a person you need to keep, 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 keep them out of your energy. It's almost like freezing accounts, some shit like that as well. See that fake ass hand there, and then you got that sword. Someone just trying to get in. Someone trying to manipulate you. Someone trying to gain access to your uh, um, intellectual shit as well. Your phone, your accounts, pretending to be you. So watch your passcodes. Watch all that shit. Deep freeze energy. Some of y'all maybe you need to freeze your, uh, um, oh, what do they call it? Your credit scores. You definitely got a fraudulent person around you. Fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Uh, Scorpio here at the bottom of the deck. Uh, this could be someone that you know you can't trust. So they still might be up on some fuck shit. So just uh, keep that in mind, fire signs. That's very interesting. Mm. I need a cigarette after that. Uh, with that cold energy, this could be someone close to you that you had to kind of put on ice. Some of y'all need to freeze your accounts or just pay very close attention, especially if you're dealing with someone that knew your social security number, your all that personal information, if they could start up an account under your name. Maybe you might have to freeze some accounts because you left this person out in the cold. Now, if this isn't someone that you know, some of y'all just pay attention to that energy. They're going to come out and like make a, fight, a false offer just to get your information and then bam, they're going to be gone. They could be trying to freeze you out of your accounts as well. That's very... Very specific death energy here. Uh, keep this person away. Some of y'all dead in your. Uh, it's not like dead in your accounts. Freeze, freeze your shit. If you don't plan on making any major purchases and you don't need that stuff, just prevent somebody. Yeah, because someone's spying. Someone's spying on something. Some of y'all could be looking up. Um, This could be someone from the past that you thought. This could be something from the past coming up. Someone could be trying to manipulate you. Someone's wa Who the hell are they watching? They're watching contracts. Someone's watching what the fuck you got going on. Who you're dealing with contractually. Or some of you watch who you deal with contractually. Watch, uh, watch any institutions that you use. 
where your money goes, who the hell has access to your accounts, and what the hell is up. I'm really picking up fraud here, or just someone very fake. Uh, be leery of any offers. If it sounds too good to be true, and they're wanting all your personal information, it's like, eh. If it sounds too good to be true, it probably fucking is, right? If it sounds too good to be true, you probably need to have a lawyer and an accountant in the room while you're signing this paperwork. So just kind of keep that shit in mind. For some of you, anyone you deal with, do a background check. Uh, either just do it your own or pay one of them sources to do a background check on somebody. Business, individual, it don't fucking matter. Because it feels like someone's wanting to come in and just kind of freeze what the fuck you got. Someone's up to no good. Five of Swords, someone's up to no good. Some of y'all are dealing with somebody who's up to no good. King of Cups, this could be that offer coming in. Too good to be true, hey. Business or love, y'all. Business or love, but this person is very deceptive. Yeah. This person is very deceptive. This Nine of Swords energy with the Eight of Pentacles, especially when it comes to your work or what the hell you got going on. If they want to come in, right? Anyone that wants to come in and work with you or do something with you, they got like false pretenses. Some of y'all, a lot of people don't think about it, but uh, the companies, uh, you know, companies that have your personal information, it usually, depending on how big the company is, your personal information is stored in servers all over the place, right? You have no idea who has access to your information when you fill out your tax forms and shit like that, right? They they could know your social security number and all that shit. And this is someone trying to come in and fuck with you. What the hell you got? Taking your personal information. So, y'all take that how that resonates, fire signs. But for some of you, this is shit that you, can, you can't even fucking really regulate. Because any business, any company that you work for, if they got a headquarters, they're going to have all that personal information. So anyone that they have working for them is going to have access to your information. Uh, you know, it's not like that shit is, is only seen by one or two particular people. Seven of Wands, some of you, uh, upgrade your protection, upgrade, upgrade what the fuck you got going on, or be more vigilant about your shit, okay, whatever the hell that is, your personal information, Queen of Wands, this feels like uh, the Queen of Wands with the Ten of Pentacles, and the Hierophant, and the Judgment. Now, Queen of Wands, fire signs, this could be your energy, masculine or feminine. See that Ten of Pentacles? There's the uh, Hierophant, as above, so below, and there's Judgment. Some of y'all, uh, you could be having some case where someone tried to come in and fuck with what the hell you got going on. Uh, Business-wise, money-wise. Um, there you are. Uh, clarify this Queen of Wands energy. Knight of Wands with the Ace of Swords. And the Two of Wands with the Nine of Pentacles. Queen of Swords with the Justice card. If someone's trying to fuck with your shit, they're getting caught. Nine of Wands there with that uh, Ace of Swords. You're going to be hearing a message or you could get a mess message about some sort of breach on your uh, security. Maybe for some of you when it comes to your online activities. Right? If you're this Nine of Pentacles energy... Queen of Swords with the Justice card there. Balance is going to be coming in, but you could have to block somebody. This is like blocking what the hell you got. Work, love, life. Someone could be trying to come in and just fuck with everything that you got. Uh, we got the Hierophant, Judgment, and the Justice card here. So if anyone's trying to fuck with some shit, uh, it's going to get taken care of in the proper channels. You just got to watch uh, who the hell you're dealing with. Watch anybody that comes in. Watch anybody that has access to any of your personal shit. Your computers. Um, some of y'all freezing your accounts. Some of y'all could definitely be dealing with somebody who was using your information. Falsifying your information. You could be hearing about that. Or someone's going to find out about it. Someone's going to figure it out. Uh, that someone was... Uh, you know, this could be someone trying to pretend to be you, right? 
And you're going to have to block them. This is whatever the hell you got going on. Things are definitely going to get balanced out. Uh, fire signs, I do feel this is someone trying to pretend to be you. Someone trying to take advantage of you. Someone trying to use whatever the hell you got. We got this swords energy here. Now, you all tell me, Justice, the Hierophant, Judgment, Queen of Swords energy, Ace of Swords energy, Five of Swords energy. Uh, someone could be getting found out where they tried to use your information. Someone getting caught up in what the fuck they did with your communications. So for some of you, this could be multiple accounts that someone's getting caught up on what the fuck they did. Fucking with your shit. Fucking with your name. Fucking with what the hell is yours. Security, keep your security up. Uh, anything you do online. Someone's getting caught up. Now, if you've dealt with this energy, some of y'all might not even know this shit's been going on. You could be hearing about this. Some of y'all could be someone close to you. Decided to use your information. Anyone that has access to all your shit can do shit. They're coming after what the fuck you got. Because you're showing up here Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles energy. Right? Definitely could be work related. I am judgment there at that ace of swords. Truth's being called out. Protection's being put in place. Some of you, maybe this is the protections you need to put in place. You might be having to get an attorney to help you figure out some shit, right? To put a stop to some stuff. Because someone was definitely pretending to be you when they weren't. They were up to no good. That sword's energy, your communications. They were ta tapping your phone, tapping your computers, trying to tap into your accounts. Make changes, create accounts under your behalf. So some of y'all that freeze, freezing your credit score so no one can get anything off of you or on your shit. Some of you could be having to pay somebody to go through and look to make sure no accounts were made in your name. Blocking. Fire signs, I almost feel like this person done knows they're getting caught up in some shit. Whether you know about this or not. Someone could be figured out that people are, 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 it's like they're tracing back accounts. They're tracing back things. They're looking. If someone starts looking into something, they're seeing. Fake account. This feels like fake accounts being made. With your personal information. Not going to be for everybody. Those of you that know if this is something you got to concern yourself about. What was I going to do? I was going to do the... Let, let's do the Queen of Swords and let's do this Queen of Wands. This Queen of Swords energy could actually be an attorney or someone that, that's hired to come in and kind of help protect you. Kind of help you clean up uh, what the hell mess somebody else did. Clarify this Queen of Swords energy. Queen of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Two of Cups, Knight of Cups, and the uh, Seven of Wands. This feels like if you brought somebody in to maybe check or watch a situation, this is like an extra security blanket. The Queen of Wands, or Queen of Swords here with the Seven of Wands, Nine of Cups, Two of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. This is, you're going to vet anybody that comes towards you, any business opportunities. For some of you, this is hiring somebody to go through and look at your connections, who you deal with business-wise, money-wise, to kind of protect you. This is definitely a protective energy. Protecting you and your assets. Who is this Queen of Wands energy? Clarify this Queen of Wands energy. What is this Queen of Wands energy? Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands with the Nine of Cups at the bottom of the deck. For some of you, if you're dealing with love, if you've met somebody all of a sudden and they come in and they're all lovey-dovey and all up your ass and wanting to get married quick. Some of y'all, you best get a fucking prenup before you get into any further with this person. Do a little bit of investigating. Prenup energy. Because you could just be dealing with somebody who wants to come in under a false front to gain access to your shit. About most places, right? You Once you get married, 
you own each other. It's 50-50. So watch any connections that you get into. Have a fucking prenup. Especially if you're the one that's got the shit. Because just because someone looks like they got money doesn't mean they fucking do. Right? This Queen of Swords energy with that Seven of Wands. This is the person that says, hey, 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 wait. Before you sign that paper, before you do anything, you better protect your assets. I don't care how much in love they say they are. You better find out about this person before you put all your fucking money uh, into their basket. Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. This could be you personally having your stability. And this is any assets that you've got. So, uh, that could be the person coming towards you, right? A fake lover. Just trying to come in so they can uh, defraud you out of some shit. And take from you and leave you out in the cold. I didn't get uh, uh, someone from the past coming back. But for a lot of you... Watch any love offers. If someone's all quick and ready to go to get married and do all this shit, and you got some stability, you got your own shit, you better protect your own shit. You better protect your own shit. Now's not the time to get all fucking stupid in love. Not when it comes to your money. Love is love. Money is money, right? Uh, here's your personal life. Here's your business, your financial life. Do not let the two intermix. That's going to be for somebody... Pay attention. Pay attention. Some of y'all might be hearing about a security breach and you might have to freeze your shit because uh, you don't know who the hell got what. Uh, so just pay caution to that. Fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You can ring my bell. Ring my bell. Ring a ring a ring. I, I, I feel like we need to pull another card. What else do you want uh, fire signs to know about this? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I feel there's something else you need to know. King of Wands, Will of Fortune, and the Strength card. The King of Wands, this could be my masculine fire sign energy. That Strength card, Leo showing up here. Now is the time that Will of Fortune energy keeps getting drawn back to um, Ace of Pentacles. Your money. Your stability. Uh, you got a good opportunity coming in, but don't fuck it up. King of Wands, now we had the Queen of Wands. You could be meeting your match. Uh, Leo energy, Sagittarius energy here. Um... Sagittarius, what the fuck are you? Temperance. <sighs> Bottom of the deck here, six of swords, seven of swords, the death card. This almost feels like don't take any unnecessary risk, y'all. If you meet somebody new... Pay a little bit of attention. Here's a Magician, the Two of Pentacles, and the Ten of Swords. With the Eight of Swords. Don't be in the Three of Swords. Don't be all fucking caught up in some shit. If you know you got a lot to give, and someone's looking at you as being a mill ticket, your ass better be looking at things from a more logical standpoint. Or you're just going to lose your ass and, and be pretty much flat out broke, busted, heartbroken, and some of y'all in some fucking trouble here. Uh, for some of you, this could be who you're dealing with. This magician here, and then you got this, this fucking energy right here. As whoever the hell's getting caught up in some shit, they know their shit's getting caught up. Here's that nine of swords energy again. So they know they're, they're in some shit. Now, those of you, if you're dealing with the past partner, that if you had one tax return done with them, right, and they have all your personal information, they could be out there setting up accounts under your fucking name. Magician energy here. Stay focused on you. Stay positive. Don't be fucking. Don't be fucking around with that will of fortune energy. When you know you're manifesting good and you got good things coming in, you keep manifesting for you. Because it feels like whoever the hell has done some shit to you is gonna get their shit caught up. So your your best bet is to put it into some shit. 
right? If you meet somebody and within two or three months they talk a marriage and shit, you best have a fucking prenup. Those of you dealing with someone from the past, check check your check accounts, check accounts, go through and look. Make sure uh, no one's setting up accounts under your name, especially if they have access to all your personal information. So, fire signs, take that how that resonates. I hope that's not everybody's energy, but if you feel that is yours, if they haven't been caught yet, they're getting ready to get caught. Uh, it's just a matter of time, and you could be hearing news of this. So, peace, love, and light, uh, fire signs.